rare wallet of Viking era, treasure found in Isle of Man. Two British metal detectorists have unearthed a rare hoard of thousand-year-old silver coins on the Isle of Man, shedding light on a vibrant Viking era economy where traders and cash moved through England and Ireland. Most of the 36 coins were minted during the reign of Edward the Confessor, one of the last Anglo-Saxon kings to rule England, and during Poe's childhood the country faced a Viking raid and invasions. Two earlier rulers, Edwin's father, Atherland, and the Viking king, Knut, are also represented in the coins. John Crown and David found the coins in May while metal detecting with permission to private land. They were later studied by US based research Christian Barothold Collins, an expert on Viking Age coins from the Isle of Man. The island served as an ideal base between Ireland and British for the Vikings who arrived from Scandinavia in the 800s, initially exploring and killing before trading and eventually settling. This new hoard might be compared to a wallet contained all kinds of credit cards, notes and coins, perhaps of different nationalities such as when you prepare to travel over seas and show uh, the varieties of currency available to an Irish sea trade or inhabitants of men in the period, broad hold Collins said. Having this much closely date comparative material from separate finds is highly unusual, she said. Other Viking era treasure had been discovered over the years in seats across Europe, including the Isle of Man. More Viking Age silver had been discovered per square kilometer in the Isle of Man than in England, Ireland, Scotland and Wales, said Alison Fox, curator for archaeology for Manx National Heritage. Authorities in the Isle of Man, a self-governed territory under British sovereignty, officially declared the latest find as treasure on Monday. It will be displayed at the Manx Museum in Douglas until October 13.